Hello and welcome back to my channel. You might be wondering why I'm not wearing any makeup in this video. That's because today we go shave my face. So Jenna Marbles just did a video. I mean, like just did, but you're not gonna see this video for a while still. Uh, but she did a video about shaving her face, and I love Jenna Marbles. She's like, especially now that she's super into like beauty videos, she's like so good. So I really wanted to do it, and I thought I could do it. Uh, as a Tuesday review video with the Tweezerman Bright Complexion Facial Dermaplaner. So I had no idea what dermaplaning meant before I bought this, but I looked it up and basically it just means removing that top dead layer of skin and your little like hairs. So this does both of that, apparently. The last time I did a Tweezerman review on my channel was two or so years ago, a long time ago, and I had bought that like U-shaped, the spring thing that you roll on your face and it pulls all the hair out. I didn't like that. Uh, I feel like it wasn't bendy enough. Like, I've tried other ones since, and they're, like, really floppy, and that one was really stiff. Uh, so that's why it didn't work. But I'm hoping we have better luck with this. So on the back of the box, it says, Bright Complexion Facial Derma Planner at Home Facial Tool for Professional Quality Results. Exfoliates dead, dull skin cells for a brighter, cleaner complexion. Replaceable, high-quality stainless steel blades. Easily slide out and click into place. See inside for important use, caution, and care information. I bought this at Shoppers Drug Mart and it was hefty. It was a hefty $45. Can you believe that? $45 for this little pink thing. So it's got like little vials inside that are the uh, the razor heads and I guess you're supposed to replace them. And then beyond that, it doesn't seem like it comes with a lot of instructions. So I actually looked it up online, a couple of different websites, and it turns out that Ulta had the best explanation. So let's take a look at that. Details, how to use. Wash face with warm water and a gentle cleanser. I did just wash my face. Skin should be damp while using tool. I'll have to dampen it again. Skin may be prepped with moisturizer or serum prior to use. Old tool flat against surface of skin with blade at 90 degree angle. Move tool gently with a light pressure and short strokes in a downward motion over forehead, cheek, chin, and nose areas. Maximum three strokes per area. Move derma planer in an upwards motion to remove vellus hair or peach fuzz. Use device one time per week maximum. Do not use on dry, irritated, broken, or sunburned skin, or active acne. So I guess it's time to try this now, which means I have to go get a damp cloth. So I will be right back. I've got a face cloth. I've got a mirror. I've got a headband to hold my hair back. Yeah, baby. I'm gonna zoom you in like hella so you can see everything. And that's as far zoomed in as we can get. Okay, great. So I watched a video on how to do this. So hopefully I don't cut my face open even though it's kind of scary. I'm not really getting anything. If I spend $45 on this thing and it doesn't even work, I'm going to be upset. It's not working very well on me. This feels softer. Okay, I was being very gentle before and now I'm being much rougher and it's getting the job done. Let's do my mustache again. It like refuses to remove this bit here. Now that I have used this to dermaplane my whole face, uh, I'm gonna tell you honestly that I don't think it's worth $45 at all. Like, I don't feel like it did a very good job, to be honest. My face definitely feels smoother. 
and nicer, but I was hoping for like a lot of hair removal and I didn't really do that. Maybe I didn't push hard enough, but I'm afraid of like tearing my face open, you know? I still have like a lot of peach fuzz. Like a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Yeah, no, it doesn't take off enough hair for my liking, and so that's my biggest issue with it. Uh, other than that, it was fun, and my face definitely feels smoother, but I was hoping for more hair removal. And anyway, that's it for this video. Have you tried this? If you have, let me know what you think. Maybe you had better results than I did. Uh, Jenna Marbles definitely had better results than I do. And, uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!